F-250. It ain't a diesel, but it's pretty clean. And a little rod around the corner. What the heck's going on here? What's that clipping and clopping? Holy cow! The horses are at full gallop! They're working horses. You wonder what we're doing here? I took a ride south. We're having some pancakes and real maple syrup. We're out in the woods. We're in farm country. There's some rides taking place today. Got the Hyundai. Economical Hyundai. 23 miles per gallon last fill up and it's maple syrup time. Parker Family Maple Farm. Mm-mm. Real maple syrup. No Aunt Jemima. With a corn sweetener or high fructose, whatever. Got some duckies. Got a little brook. Not running too high. Parker's Sugar House, West Chazy, New York, on the Slauson Road. Everybody's here with the kids and grandkids, and the water's running. And we think of our friends in North Dakota having some flood waters and doing their best. Doing more than their best. Parker's Maple Farm. Doing their best to keep the waters from flooding the area. It's bad. I watched a few videos. And here was what it looked like. A little tap in the maple tree. And the maple syrup drips in when the temperature warms up during the day. But as soon as the tree goes to bud, which is getting real close. Uh oh, kids running in the street. That's not good. As soon as the tree goes to bud, the maple syrup gets bitter and the season's over. That's going to happen any minute. There it is. Hey, look, maple Daddy. syrup. <laughs> Usually they keep a cover on the bucket, but they just got the covers off so people could see how the system works. Otherwise, you get bugs inside. That's what the authentic maple syrup taps look like. Now they use blue tubing and lines that get cleaned and then they vacuum the syrup out of the trees and it's faster and more efficient except when the lines get damaged. Real maple syrup. Boiled off probably 90% water and 10% maple product. We put it on our pancakes and we enjoy. Gobble gobble. Oh.